Fighting Maroons had arguably their best lineup in a long time last year, headlined by veterans Woody huh? Boy and Marty Season, and the season still ended terribly for joining us now live in studio. Our new head coach, Ricky Dandan, assistant coach, Mark Dandan, and team members, Garth <laughs> Uh What's the what overview uh, uh, of the team this coming season vis-a-vis okay. uh, -vis what happened last year? What, what season? The, hopefully, our mindset uh, will be the big change. Uh, we lost, uh, well, they lost a lot uh, from last year, but mm -hmm. we actually are not looking at what we lost, <laughs> we're looking at what we have. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're fielding a 15-19 this year, mm -hmm. and uh, like I said earlier, we, we are very hopeful that uh, we will have positive results mm -hmm. for the season. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, uh, Ricky, coming into uh, the UP uh, team right after uh, last season ended, you were given the responsibility of, of uh, putting together or, or taking over a team that had a lot of pressure now from the UP community to, to perform better. So with this lineup, what was the first thing you told them uh, when you took over? December 1, the first words they heard from me, the first word they heard from me was change, mm -hmm. not the profanities. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> 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 okay, okay. Yeah, uh, of course, the main change was me, I was the oh, new guy, oh, no. but mostly a change in mindset from the because team, 0 14 yeah. is, you know, uh -huh. uh, the whole community was really uh, <laughs> devastated, uh, devastated say, say the the, yeah. yeah, to say the least. But uh, we are very hopeful, like I said. Uh, hopefully, we have uh, exercised all of the negative feelings from last season <laughs> to come into this new season. Look, looking, looking at them uh, from a coach's standpoint and from how you saw them last year, um, how, how do you see this team vis a vis how they were last year? Yeah, what, what's, what, what marked the difference did you notice? Uh, so far? It's a little difficult because from the outside looking in. Uh, but they know this. I, I always tell them this. Uh, we've been together for seven months. I'd like to think that uh, we already have this strong, positive mindset. Mm -hmm. uh, the previous year is a point of reference mm -hmm. for, for all okay. of us, uh, something mm -hmm. that we would not want to repeat, of course. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, with, with the entry now of an Alinko Emba into your lineup was 6-7, um, how much of an impact has he been so far in the preseason? I think he's a work in progress, but uh, we are very pleased with him. He's a fighter. Uh, he's uh, he's been integrated into the system very well. Uh, of course, he's our only legitimate center, so mm -hmm. he'll really be a big factor for us. And uh, his teammates love him. Uh, that's uh, what is best about it. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, Mark. Uh, Coming into uh, this season, you know, everybody's talking about the other teams. Uh, what do you think are some of the surprises that UP is going to pull this season? Well, if the people saw how UP played last season, if they're going to compare it to our team this mm. year, it's it, definitely there's going to be a lot of surprises for them. Because mm. uh, I remember Coach Riggi was interviewed a few months back. Mm. What was he going? What was he was going to bring to the team? Mm. First thing he said was. You're to put the fight back in fighting words. Mm -hmm. So that's probably the the best thing that we're going to bring for mm -hmm. the season. Uh, and, you know, we hope to surprise a lot of people. Okay. We'll open a lot of eyes.